Okay. Take two, I think. Um, I, I recorded this and the computer decided it didn't want to record it or stop recording. So, anyway, um, this is Devil's Panties video blog number nine, I think, uh, December 4th, 2008. Um, so this is the first one that I've done where I've basically recorded it anyway, so we'll see if I still have fangirl in me, which I think I do. I can talk about it all again. But we're going to try to make this quick. I have a huge stack of stuff. A um, bunch of stuff I found at the comic book store. The first one is Digger. Digger is awesome. Um, uh, Ursula does phenomenal work. Uh, I've got a ton of her prints. That the, the gerbils in the toaster, you gotta go see it. Um, some of the stuff in here, I've just read like a couple of pages in it, but uh, some some nuggets of brilliance is, uh, other than the fact that I thought I was a small stone named Edward for some time, I got off lightly. I want to get a stone and name him Edward. Um, and this little bit that uh, they're talking about a hole, he goes, leaving aside that holes by definition aren't there, I'm pretty sure it's right there. I, I sat there and pondered on the, on the deep philosophicalness of holes being lack of anything. I'm easily impressed. Um, okay. Okay. I'm even more fangirly than I was in the first place. So I have the three books that I absolutely adore because they're, they're strong feminist, uh, strong female um, werewolf vampire, you know, stories. Um, and the first, uh, there's the three of them is uh, um, uh, Magic Bites uh, is, is she's a, a bounty hunter and she's awesome. And then there's the uh, the cop, which is Blood Ties, which there's a move, there's a TV show of Blood Ties on uh, Lifetime, and I totally want to find it. Um, and then the other one is uh, Patricia Briggs, uh, uh, Mercy Thompson. It's a comic book. <laughs> okay, so usually when they make a comic book out of a, a, a novel or a movie or whatever, um, they'll just pretty much do a comic version of it. Um, but this is actually a prequel. This is is new stuff. She's a mechanic and she runs around, um, you know, doing power struggles, with vampires and werewolves, and, and it's fantastic. And oh, and the artwork. Oh my god. The uh, there's this one vampire guy that's there who is just. Oh, He's, he's fantastic. Um, God, there's there's one, this is one in four. I can't wait for the other ones to come out. Okay, so, um, and then I went to see some movies. Gear change. So I saw Twilight, and I had every intention of going and, and laughing at inappropriate moments and making all the 15 year olds cry, but um, I ended up going to a 10 o'clock showing at Midtown, which is, if you know Atlanta, it's not where the 15-year-old girls are. I saw it with a theater full of um, big black gay guys. I behaved myself. Um, but it was it was funny and it was awesome. It was very sparkly. The The movie had every, you know, all the great parts of the first book. Um, they're talking about doing one for the second book. Um, and I have issues. Anyway, um, I do love that they had little add-ins uh, in the movie that they didn't have in the books, like the dad is cleaning his gun and and the daughter gives him another beer and then says, my boyfriend's showing up. Um, and, and when he reads minds and he's like, yeah, yeah, money, sex, cat, and the guy's all dreaming about his pet cat. Okay. And then I went also to see um, Australia. Australia was really long. It was incredibly campy. It was three hours long. It ended like four times. You know, they wrapped everything up and fell into each other's arms, and the mu music came up, and the and the and the t and the camera panned back, and you thought, oh, okay, that was a nice movie, and then it keeps going. Um, and it's so campy. And what's his face is there with his shirt off the entire time, and I'm gonna go see it like three more times, because that scene with the fire, and oh my god, we laughed our ass off. He uh, is posing, and there's the water and the soap and the hands and the toothbrush. <laughs> Anyway, okay, and uh, and I got a t-shirt. I love my t-shirt. <sighs> Hot dog trucks. So to wrap it up, oh no no no, I've got. <laughs> oh, you get the the Cliff Notes version. Um. Uh, I still have stuff up on Etsy. Uh, I've got undies because it's the devil's panties. Um, so I've got my pretty princess on on pink ruffly undies, and I've got my pr uh. The, my angel girl on little boxer undie things. 
And then, when I was drawing the angel on the boxers, she had a smirk. And I don't quite know how it happened. Um, but that, just that, that little smirk that she has there. And she's got lipstick. And somehow some lipstick got on the, uh, the boxers. I, I don't know how it happened. I take no responsibility for that. Um, and the devil girl has some of her own boxers as well. Da -da 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 -da. I'm not telling where her lipstick mark is. Anyway, so those are up on Etsy. Um, book two, I I don't know. the The publisher things happened and, and it kept getting delayed, and Amazon kept canceling it because it kept getting delayed. So for those of you who have Am who had ordered book two on Amazon, I don't know. Um, I think Amazon cancel it completely. I don't know if you can just reorder it again. I don't know how that works. Um, this is why I'm going to be my own publisher for book three because so that I will be able to answer these questions. Um, I I I don't know when it's going to come out. Um, the publisher had told me maybe December 27th. I don't think it's going to make it for for uh, Christmas, um, and and I don't I don't know what's going on with it. Um, but two books did show up to my house. Um, so this means they do exist. Uh, they're big and they're heavy and, and they're glossy and oh, they're just so shiny. And then the clip notes and then yeah, we've got uh, bonus material and stuff. There's Games in the back, and and it's hardcover. I mean, oh, it's so big. Hmm. So so it's gorgeous, um, and it is coming out. I just don't know what's going on with Amazon, and I don't know if it's because it has to be shipped from China. So the boat might sink. Uh, pirates might get a hold of it. Um, so so yeah, I don't know. Uh, Hopefully the 27th. Uh, next week I will have more, hopefully more solid information for you. Um, uh, but yeah, hold on with Amazon. See if you can you can get them to order it back in. Um, and it's coming to the comic shops. Don't worry. It, I thought it had died, but apparently not. Um, so that's it. And hopefully I'll have have more information for you for that and some more stuff to geek out over um and i did read the kitty book all in two days and i'll have to geek out over that for next week um so hopefully we'll have that done and uh thank you very much for bearing with me <laughs> go see some movies